of Marlon Brando. Yeah. Imagining that, that is somehow yeah. naturalism. Yeah. That's, yeah. that's, that's mannerism. Or absolutely. Rock and roll. So is Jimmy Dean mannerism. Jimmy Dean is mannerism? Yeah, absolutely. Give me a Jimmy, Jimmy Dean mannerism. Oh, I... Isn't that him being truthful? No. I'm being naughty. I think that's him just being. But that in itself, again, to go to the pure acting discussion, just being from particular people mm -hmm. can be very powerful. Yes, and it worked for him. I mean, it's a good thing that he died when he did. But in the last stages of Giant, you can see that he was not really capable of yeah. sustaining more than yeah. what he had. Because he had to play then middle age, and he had to have some acting skills. I don't think he pulls it off. I want to go to the 18th century, and I want to go to you teaching a course study on preparing a student to do, a, a, say, a restoration play. What elements do you use? Well, a period study, as it has evolved over the years, is an, a combination of a study of history the history of a given period, a specific period. Social history, political social, history? Social history, political history, uh, spiritual history, um, all of the things that, that go to make up what was the daily life of that period, and what were the preoccupations of the people of that period. Could we take a specific example, like the country wife? Or well, what, what would be a better example? Country wife is is uh, certainly one type of one comedy. Um, the country wife is a comedy of manners. A comedy of manners written about a very small coterie of people surrounding the court or on the outer fringes of the court wanting to be aristocrats if not already born aristocrats. Uh, their wealth, if they are not aristocrats, are beginning to raise them to the position where they can live the life of the aristocrats and adopt or at least ape the manners of the aristocrats. They are, in any case, ruling class. And that means that they are obligated to do no work of any kind. They are people of leisure. They have leisure, endless leisure, to make of themselves a work of art. It's a comedy of masks. Everyone wears a mask. A social mask. A social mask. The social mask is that one is of an elite, entitled, that one is born to ease, wealth, and Everything comes easily to one. One is born to the manner. Everything succeeds. Life is a game in which everything succeeds with almost boring regularity. One is always on top of one's game. One always 
manages to succeed effortlessly. And teaching the period, do you give music? Do you give po politics? Do you give painting? We, do you give we, if all of the above? We study all of it. And then say, take give me a, spe a specific example in music. Say, well, if it's restoration, that is that sort of that hollow of middle baroque. There's it's really dominated by Henry Purcell, and all of the music that he wrote, dance music, solo songs, choral music, music for the funeral of Queen Mary, all of these various things, the opera. Dido and Aeneas. John Blow is a contemporary. He wrote a little opera. And what do you want the student to hear in the music? Um, superb form, superb proportion. Um, the the uh, elaborate style, elaborate but clear. Disciplined, controlled, and brilliant.